life. Let's see if you really try. All right, you guys. So right now it is now 4:55. I usually get up around like 4:30 to 5 every single morning because I go straight to my office first thing. So you guys, the first thing I usually do is I just knock out 100 push-ups just because it gets you active and it gets your brain doing the one thing that you know is hard right off the bat. Alright you guys, so it is now time to take a shower. I'm gonna hop in the shower real quick. In the cold shower, it's like absolutely freezing. I like to do cold showers on the weekdays just because they keep me very, very in the game and keep me very focused and they help me wake up. It's also really good on your skin. I used to have horrible acne. All right, you guys, so now that we showered, first thing we're gonna be doing is just brushing this crazy hair. As far as hair gel goes, I use this brand. This brand is fire. I feel like if you go to the store and it comes in a package that looks like this, like you know it's a quality product. So like I just started getting this stuff and it's absolutely game changing. Yeah, I still got my shampoo out here. So now we're gonna go ahead and put the pit vipers on. Put some cologne on real quick. I got a crested gecko named Tico, he's super dope. So I have to miss his cage like twice a day. He's the best little pet I could ever ask for. It was good. All right, you guys, and then the last thing I do in the morning before I head out is I actually write my goals down. Um, so I do this every morning. I actually publish this book on Amazon. It's called The Book of Thoughts. But essentially how it works is if you can see these pages in here, writing down your goals in the morning and at night will make you, you know, think about your goals as soon as you wake up and think about your goals right before you fall asleep. First thing you think about when you wake up, last thing you think about right before you go to bed, super important. So check it out. It's on Amazon if you want it, you guys. So we're heading down to my car right now. It's about to be a crazy day. So anyways, yeah, you're gonna get a real realistic. What the? What the fuck? All right, you guys, we in the office. It's a great day. It's gonna be a great Friday. Getting a lot of stuff done. All right, you guys, so we just had the team morning meeting and now basically I'm just gonna get started on some busy work. Basically handling the emails, replying to people and doing everything that I do in the morning, which is usually just my busy work. And it's gonna be a very, very exciting day. We've got a lot going on, me and my whole entire team. We're actually working on a team video as well. If you guys haven't followed my team channel, you guys go to the link in the description and follow the Chris Line Academy team channel or just type in Chris Line Academy on YouTube. We've got a team channel as well where you can see the office from the perspective of my team every single day, which is super, super sick, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I sent that girl the results. 100 racks a month from students. Advice for anybody that's joining the military. Do what you're told. Be on time. What else is there? Do what you're told. <laughs> All right, you guys. So it is now about 8.28 a.m. I've been at the office for like an hour and a half already or two. Now I'm going to start just making some TikToks for you guys and basically doing a little bit of content as well as just working um, on my computer. I'm in the conference room just kind of chilling. But you guys, one thing I want to talk about real quick is a tip that actually changed my life. If you're having trouble like getting everything done, write everything down the night before and then plan it out in two hour increments. So basically divide up your time based off two hour increments throughout the day or three hours, whatever. Focus on a task. So I'll be like, okay, I'm working on this business. And then I'll set a timer for two hours. And as soon as that timer on my phone goes off, I quit working on that one and move to the next thing. And I just do that every single day to make sure I put, you know, needed focus time towards all the certain things that I'm working on in my life. Really, really helps you stay focused on track and make sure that you're getting stuff done every day that you need to be getting done. This is Carter with Chris Slime Media. Got the CEO here. Jeremy, what would you say to the people about maybe skeptical about getting started with online business, but have good goals and ambitions? Like, what do you say is the first step? So I'd say if you have good goals and ambitions, it doesn't really matter what your goals are if you don't have a plan to get there. Whether you're skeptical or not about online business, the thing is you're never gonna know the true answer until you try. Because if you don't try it yourself or if you don't experience something yourself, you're simply just basing your thoughts off of other people's opinions. <laughs> hey, this is Devon, Chief Operating Officer. What would you say about someone uh, wanting to get started in online business? What's your biggest tip keep grinding until you make your first sale because until you make your first sale it all just seems like you know a scam or something but once you make your first sale and you're like you wake up and you have like a thousand dollars made before you even brush your teeth it's pretty mind-blowing up there and over here hacking you should barely work at sir yeah. sir <laughs> hacker so, new student signed up she's awesome sir, she came out the creator chat right yep the creator chat from UK motivated 16 years old all right you guys so quick little office 
this tour. So over here is basically just a bunch of desks. So we just got a bunch of like cubicles, desk little areas right over here. So as we go down this little hallway, just a bunch more cubes, desks, lots of space, lots of room to do whatever, have more people. Hopefully some of you guys watching one day are on the Crystalline team. But inside of here is kind of the cool first room to check out. This is actually the negativity room. So this is basically the area to go if you're like, you know, sad, angry, stressed out, or if you need to like aggressively vape or, you know, hit your dab pen uncontrollably. You have to take it in this room and keep it outside of the actual office and the actual, you know, floor out there. We've got our little guy right here. We've got the velocity symbol. We share an office with the amazing company Velocity. I have an interview with the CEO of Velocity, Todd McCartney, on my channel as well. It's all pitch black because nobody's here right now. We have the conference room or the family room. This is where everybody hangs out. This is where we do our morning meetings, as you guys have probably seen on the channel before. Fuck yeah! There. <laughs> all right you guys so it is now like 3 or 4 p.m and it's been an absolutely insane day all right you guys so i'm with maverick right now say what's up Mav. what's up guys we just left the office and we're actually at the mall right now which is right across the street from the office i'm about to go shopping because it's devon who's a member of the crystalline media team the actual coo of crystalline media he's having a baby shower tomorrow so i'm getting some gifts What's up you guys, it's Jeremy Ray. Welcome back to my unboxing channel. Today we're gonna unbox a random bag from Target. First, we've got the Quest peanut butter cups. You guys, if you're ever hungry and you're in a situation where you don't wanna eat a granola bar, these Quest peanut butter cups are the way to go. We got this crazy baby piano, so we got this for Devon. What we also did was we went ahead and got some baby clothes. I had to get the Adidas jumpsuit and I had to get the little elephant little toy. Boom, America jumpsuit. Some little shoes, which I think the shoes are super sick. And then we got got a little pacifier thing that looks pretty sick. It's like something you could put on your keychain or something, but it looks like super clean and like aesthetic. The other thing we got for the baby was this. This thing is really crazy. If you can see that picture, it's like it's super crazy. It looks like super modern and you can like fold it up. I don't know if you can see that thing on the top and like carry it super easy. And yeah, I don't know why I'm showing you this stuff with you guys right now, but I really just wanted to like, you know, show you guys an actual day in my life. With that being said, I'll keep going. So then we got some stuff for my sister. This is all wrapped up and super nice, but it's some crazy, crazy crazy like Valentino perfume that's uh, super sick and it's like wrapped super, super nice and I do not know how to tie a bow. So I'm not gonna untie this and show you guys, I'm very sorry. I'm super excited for Devon and Hannah. If you guys are watching this, I love you guys. You guys are amazing. Devon's the COO of Crystalline. So now that dinner is done, I'll show you guys what I'm having. So right here is a little mixture that I don't know what I call it, but it's just basically a mixture of stuff. So it's basically turkey, potatoes, egg whites, and brown rice, as well as broccoli I throw in there and mushrooms. And it's basically just a combination of a bunch of stuff that's super low in like calories, but fills you up and gives you like the nutrients your body needs. And then this is basically Greek yogurt with cherries, blueberries, granola, peanut butter. But I basically eat this every single night. What you eat is really, really important to your overall you know mental health into your overall way that you're you know productive throughout the day One of the best things about my day-to-day -day routine and what I do on a daily basis is no matter what I have going on, I make sure I prepare myself the night before because it keeps you focused on what is important because if you don't go into the day with a plan, you go into the day and the day is just taking you over. If you go into the day with a plan, you control the day. You know what you're gonna do, you know what you need to get done, you go and you get it done. <laughs> 